Welcome back to Stasinius and welcome to Mars, the beautiful red planet. We are today starting our first steps into making our survival base here on this beautiful planet. Here we have our lander with all our standard starting equipment. <clears throat> and let's just get you up and running again. Let's first get some blocks out. Oh, lovely, we are landing on some cover. It's nice. Let's get this in there. Uh, that was the wrong one. I want to mold. Once I can do for now. I want our welder. Now, where is so the sun? Is there? Obviously. Uh, let's start in. Hmm. Yeah, we can this direction. So we we do three. We can do a simple small kind of set up to top it so a, sm a small three by three on both sides maybe a little bit more on one side on one side it's going to be called greenhouse like like this <coughs> small starting greenhouse we can always expand it on the other side we're going to build out again three maybe more later on but three at least for now so we can have our our greenhouse in this particular area no not greenhouse our manufacturing and, and printers <clears throat> sorry let's get that there let's get our sheets just so we can weld them up first time so we can stand on them without falling through so that's the foundation let's also do the arc around here mainly so we can build stuff on here and we'll get back to that later uh we want some materials so in here not that one hmm. let's see what do we have we want a where is it we definitely want a i'm stuck we want to start off with getting our uh Let's get rid of that. Get rid of this, our generator, our furnace, and our authlate. And then up here we have a basic solar panel. We want to remove our pill. Because we don't really need that right now. We can put our welder in back here. So let's put our, our um, solar panel. We're just going to put it basically down for now. That's one. Our authorate, which is the basic printer starting. Well, let's just put it here, where both power and data point towards us. We want to put a. Yeah, we're going to put our authorate. No, not our arc furnace over here. We're not going to use the arc furnace very much, so we just quickly put it in. We're only going to put it until we get our furnace up and running. And then we want a generator. And we might as well put that up here for now. And the reason we put it this way is um, because we're going to have a cable coming down here. And then we might pop the battery somewhere. We don't know. We, we might move it later. Who knows? So, we now need an APC. Area power controller. We have one right there. We actually have two. This is like our first, our starting up battery. Uh, and as you can see, we have an ingoing and outgoing. We want to be sure that the outgoing is pointing towards our machines. You can win there. So we want to take some cables. Mm, nope. And our cable cutter. Now, let's put this one in place here. Like so. Mm hmm. Yes, there we are. Ah, uh, come on, there we are. Brilliant. Now we just need some glass that we can actually produce power. Perfect. We and we need to replace the crowbar with the cable cutter. The crowbar is to op open up the um, the APC, and we're going to take a large battery and pop in there. <clears throat> so we can charge but we might we might even replace 
place it with our current. Yeah, it's on. It's working. We can just leave it for open for now. Now we just need to cable up our machines. That data is power. Lovely. Okay, so we need some steel sheets for this one. So let's get rid of these and this one. We want a welder. Yeah, let's get rid of this one again. It's not cables now, it's a plastic first. It's cables. And then we want some plastic. We have that over here. Let's pop that in there and pop the cables in there as well. This one up here. So there's a lot of things in those cave, uh, boxes that we actually don't need. It's, uh, it's good for a survival kit, but it's really not useful. So let's pop the screwdriver on it. There we are. And he works. If you turn that on at least. Yeah, perfect. Okay. That's it. Uh, we need some glass for this. For, for the solar panel. So we can actually do some sun. It's just some power from the sun. Of course, we are almost down, so we don't really produce anything that much tonight. However, we are going to quickly get a setup so we can actually produce our first solar panel, um, normal solar panel, and we can automate that. Uh, for that, we need some steel and copper and gold, I think it is. But we need to produce our uh, electronic printer and pipe printer. Oh, the reason why I'm building these now is just because this is how it's going to be. They're going to be up there so we can place our our solar panels up there for now. And then we might place more, but <clears throat> for now it's going to be like that. Right, I will empty my my uh, my inventory as much as I can. And then I will go out mine as much as I can. Quite a lot. Hopefully. So, uh... I will be back as soon as I can, and then we will continue. That was a good night. I got a little bit of everything, a bit of gold, a bit of silicon, some copper, some 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 iron, some copper, some volatile, and some oxide. Not so much oxide as I want to put by some right there, so I'm not too bust about it. Now, let's get straight on to, we want to produce our electronic printers right away. So let's see, what does that need? Electronic printer. And some gold and cover that we can do straight on mm, what do we want to do there uh, let's see the furnace first yeah we might as well do the furnace first we want to do some copper in there boing uh, da, 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 da. And we might, uh, while we wait for the furnace to be produced, we're going to put a closet or a closet, a, 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 a thing over there. You can continue that and you will make... That was not even remote enough. See, this is why I want the furnace. The furnace is a lot faster. While we wait for this a thing to melt, which takes forever, we're going to take the locker, just so we can actually store some things. Do you want to put it like this or like this let's put it like this what do we have they i will probably make that that's enough for now so we're gonna pop that in there pop that in there even all of it except of course our eyes we cannot we cannot take our eyes in because they will melt but everything else can go uh oh yeah and as we can see we have we have 150 gold a uh, 50 iron and 50 uh, 50 coal this is enough to make steel to make 200 of steel so come on is that enough it is great thank you produce this takes a long time while it's making that we might as well get some walls and 
starting on building our walls or actually our windows. Yeah, this wasn't the best idea. Why do I close it? I start making the windows in the green room, which I will now from now on call it. Start frames, yeah, that's frames. So window <laughs> none of that, obviously. Window, window, window. Perfect. Let's do the top. Lovely stuff. So now we can at least put some some sheets on that and then finish the side. So things cannot fly around. Um It it all takes time. Where did I put my sheets? They should be in here, they're not. Where did I put them? Mm, that's a good question. Put them over here. I might have. Yeah, they're right there. We also can take that. And put that in there. And the glass. <laughs> How does it go? 59. Jesus, it takes a long time. So, oh, too high, jump too high. So now that we have uh, soon established this beginner room, which is very simple, we can lock it up and actually uh, have a safe haven from the storm. Which we, we don't like the storm. The storm is always annoying in the way. Uh, we could make some fans. Uh, it's called turbines, what they're called, to produce way, uh, to produce power from the, from, the, from the storm. That's about it. Uh, that was too much. Ah, we'll leave for now. They need to be up anyway. Yay, we have that. Furnace, so let's see. Pop it down like this. That will be fine. Yeah. Now you straight into an electronic printer. Do electronic. Window. Yeah. Mm. Or do we do the pipe? No, we do this one. I don't f because I don't think we have a active, uh, a passive window here, but we can we can work with it for now. We want to find this pipe. This was really a bad to mine here. Mm, pipes and a valve. Dressing critical. So, pop that there, pop that, pop that there. You want some shit? In. Sorry. Crowbar. Of course you want crowbar. No. What does it say? Lens. And some welding now. Seriously. What's over this one? There we are. I'm missing something. What am I missing? My screwdriver. Did I put it over here. I lost my screwdriver. Yes, I did. Yeah. Oh. Over that. So, let's put this output. some frames put some frames down there I need my rinse there my rinse remove that and remove my rinse again six there yep Let's get some water while we remember it. This is um, the best way right now. We don't have a room yet. We can. I mean, I can actually breathe in, so it's a bit annoying. 
That's how it is. Uh, do we want power? We have no power. Do you want to get a pipe? That's not pipe. Pipe bender. So we hmm. how, mu how much iron do we have? Have we? Wow. I don't have enough iron. Oh well. Now that the sun is gone, we can actually melt it quickly. So let's do that. That's not the one I want. I want this melter. Let's just swap them around. It's a bit faster that way. So let's do a six and three. So six volatiles. One, two, three, four, six. My counting is spot on. So come on, come on, come on, come on. Yep. And then our. Oh, that's not. There we are. I need she shot. On. But you see that? It produces processes so so quickly. It's nice. So we'll just take some more steel. Not more steel yet, some more coal. Mm -hmm -hmm. Of course this one is now pretty hot. It's also what we want. We want it to be hot. And steel. Thank you. That's what we want. Let's produce some copper. And some more copper. Mm -hmm. Just go in there. And some silicone. Ah. Uh, It might be too. Hold that now. Oh, perfect. Let's put that. Ah. I mean, it's not ideal the way I put it up, but it's it's working. So if I had some more. Um, yeah, if I had some more iron, I could reduce that. But I could go and get some. Uh, let's first build this one. So we move this stuff and get away. Most plastic. It's there. And the wall again. Ah, too quick. Okay. <clears throat> No more switching around here. Look at that. We have an electronic printer. Lovely. It's going to be a most important friend, to be honest. Because you're going to be. Would you please turn off? You're going to be producing so much cable, it's crazy. Of both, of both types, like heavy and normal. They are very expensive in that. Unless, of course, you can run a bit out of automation. But who plays this game without augmentation? It works. Lovely. Now let's see. We want a solar panel. Oh, solar panel. You want steel, copper, and gold. That we can make. Let's get rid of this. Let's just clean up our packs first. Did, uh, did steel. Copper. Ah, gold. Copper. Is that enough? Nope. There we are. That is enough for two. Yeah. So while it's printed this, I'll run out and ping up some more gold. Yeah, some more gold. Uh, sorry, not some more gold, some more copper. I cannot talk. Some more iron, of course. Maybe also some more gold and copper if I can find any, so we can just get that smelted and get that up to running. So, see you in a bit. Okay, 
we have a little bit of everything. Well, not as much as I expected, but we have a little bit. So let's first do our gold quickly. That's, that's done. That out of the way. Yoink. Let's do the last of the iron we've got. So, 505 iron, that should last us for... Not a lot. <laughs> not a very long time. But it will last us for a mm, decent amount of time. Yeah. And done. We might as well take the cobalt. No, we can't. The cobalt will just stay there. So, let's come with me. You go in there. Have that. Set the cobalt in there. <clears throat> what does I want to do? I want to do a. We want to put up the solar panel. So, while we do that, pipe. And do we have that? We don't have the copper, it's over here. No. Nope. Okay. We're gonna build build the pipe bender. And then while we wait for the pipe bender to come back, our uh, the um for the cover to come back, we will start on our oh, that that one. Start on our solar panels. That in there. And we want our iron sheets. That's not, that's plastic sheets. I have them on me, so that's why I can't find them. So, these is the automatic one that you can control by um, settings, like with um, logic. So with that you can get a quick and pretty precise reading on the sun. And you can then control where your um, cut it. That won't be a bit. There we go. Um, so we want it so both power and data faces to the west. Because that's the east where the sun goes up. And with that, we know now that we can that way opinion we can now lock that in oh God, come up here so we put that in here straight, straight cable straight cable straight cable lots of straight cables here and now almost out of straight cables well these are almost out of cables right in some glasses, do we have the mouse? We do. That's clever. Should almost think they'll push down the side. And they are producing power. So we will soon, when we have the gold and cover from this one. Did I not tell it to start? Okay. Well, then we can do the setup of that before. So we want to set up, we want a reader, so logic, IO, a logic reader, a logic <laughs> writer. Because then we can actually control that one straight away, those two straight away. Uh, it's, it's a fairly simple system. It's not like, takes two of these and a, and a center. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. And get up with the rest of it. Plug it in over here. Oh, bitch. Yeah. Okay, so while we are doing that, you will do a pipe bender. So tell you to. Ah, that's the same. Did I not bring over the sensor? I guess not. Turn off. We don't have enough cables for it, of course, but... That is a different matter. No, sensor here. Okay. So, we want... 
We want a data center. We want to paste it in the, the data part of it. We want to face north, which is that direction. So, like this. Now we want a... Um, we want, we're going to move it. We want a logic uh, reader, which is going to read from that one. Then we want a batch writer. Batch means multiple. So you can write to more than one uh, uh, thing. So basically you're going to write to all solar panels on this network. And we're going to pop this here. So we're going to have a power APC here. So we're going to separate the power which is here and here. We're going to separate that from the rest so it doesn't have a short circuit. Perfect. Now, how does this go here? How are you going? Brilliant. While we wait for that, I'll pick up my doors because we as need them as well. They is they are here. Mm, kit door. We might. Uh, yeah, why not? No, nope. and we also take this. Our charger, because now we are sort of getting more power soon. So we, uh, before I get into that, let me just eat some, because my little man here is hungry. So open, unlock, open. Perfect. Thank you. I love it when I'm trying to die. So we put in a console, we can just put it here. Doesn't really matter for now. Let's see, let's know. The type of airlock we're gonna make is a advanced airlock. And I do advanced because I am not happy about mixing air. So when I know I have two different atmospheres, which I have here, then oh, where is it? Is it here? No, that's all scan. Where is it? There you are then i want to have an advanced the normal airlock i don't really use because it's more for one-sided and i don't like it i always prefer to split my air network analyze we don't need atmos we don't need right now you can go to that no you can go into to there if it's hot enough I, no 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 are you hot enough let's see mm. No, you're not. Ah. We can just come here. Uh, we can put that one up there. Mm -hmm. So, is this necessary? No, it's not. It's just, then you have a battery to back up these three. And you always have a good way of... Them. Oh, stop, 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 stop. Are you crazy, man? Put that in there. Let's produce some cables. We want to produce a fair bit of cables. Uh, while you're doing that, let's just pop down our... Our... Um, no, that's not the one I want. Our... Pipe bender. Yeah. And we move this again. What's the grind? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There we are. While it's do doing that stuff down there, we can we might as well go up here and put some cables. So first it's straight there. Straight there. And Junction there. Turn. Let's just change this. Because we can save a little bit of cable here. But we make this a reader and this a batch rider. So now this. Uh, no. No, we can't, because the input is here, and we want, ah, no, we're going to change it around again. Ah, screw it, we leave it like this, it doesn't matter. 
Turn this off. You should also be st stuck soon. Don't need any more of this for now. We need this our labeler and our screwdriver. So that's the data sensor. And we don't really need to label this, but I want to. So, uh, sun, vert, read, ah, solar cell. Right. Something like that. Doesn't really matter. Okay, so input here. It's going to be our stellar sensor. Hmm. Ah, see what I did there? That's ah, lovely. That's a good idea. Because this is an output, this is an input. So it's trying to see if an output, but no, I can't. Oh yeah. Yes, that's better. Uh, we go up there. Right. So we want to see from the data center. We want to see the vertical, which is the vertical angle. Then this one want to have the input from the vert read. It want to put output for the solar panels, which is these two. And I want to put out the vertical angle of them. Now let's get a battery and just turn it all on. And then when we have sun tomorrow, they will give us about 87% power all day. Uh, around. It's between 87 and 81. Uh, sorry, 87 86. Okay. Let's turn him on. And oh, that was not supposed to happen. And let's turn that one on. Hmm. Did it not turn it on? Wow. Nice. Let's just remove them again. I am an idiot. Power is on the upside down. Well, you know, bloody greed. That's right. Yeah, now we have the data input there. I thought it looked weird. Let's just remove this. This one has power, yes, and this is a read. You can see the input there, which is only this one. So now it's like before. But you can only see one thing. When I click here, you can only see that one. We save the bunch of cables. Nice. So, you want to see the vertical. The solar, uh, the, the, the vertical, which is now uh, 79 degrees. And then on the on this one, we want to again see the logic read. Now I don't want to name them. Oh, can't be asked. We want to write to the solar panel, which is these two. And we want to write the vertical. See? Lovely. Now we do want to turn them before because they are not facing the right way. I think. Uh, what is it? Oh, if I can remember this. That's the vertical. Uh, I think you have to be 90 if I'm not wrong. Yeah, so we'll really find out tomorrow. That is that for now. Lovely. Now we are doing this one. So we want. <clears throat> we have one sheet left. Let's do a welding of it. 
Two sheets. Sheets. Alarmed. Okay. And some cables. Stop that with you. Okay, stop, 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 stop. As long as we don't have a stagger, don't we? Don't want to turn them everywhere. with you okay and the death now we need some cables and you might want to ask why do I go this way oh will you please stop annoying me old uh, this this here Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know. Oh, yeah. It's because I can always touch this one and I can always be here and take some. If I go the other way, the cable is in the way. Right. We want an active vent. Passive vent, I mean. So, vent, passive vent, want some iron. Ah, uh, no. This you want to like this, then you just throw things into here everywhere. Nice. Um, now the next thing is we want to do is we want to finish off this in here. So we want some things. I think it's in here. The first thing is an ice crusher. Things in here. Ice. Yeah, there it is. And now an ice crusher does, of course, want an ice crusher. Do have more coal? And two. Nice. I have two coals. <laughs> well, that's going to give us far. Far. Oh, well. Maybe I can make it. Can I make it? Can I make it? Can you? Yes, you can. Okay. So while we wait for daylight, we can put down this. And it's simply gonna be the crusher. Oh, daylight. It's gonna be the, the device that's gonna crush all our ice, all our water, for our base. <clears throat> for our base. I'm losing my voice, from what it sounds like. That is fantastic. My wife's gonna, my wife's gonna lie for me for that. And I think, from what I understand, we have a storm coming soon. So we might as well get these as close as done as they can be. Of course, we still don't have a glass in there. We do have them here. We can do this part. Okay, that's all the glasses. Lovely. It's done. 
now if there's a storm hitting us, it won't fly away from me near. Now look at this. They're pointing, oh 95% even better than their point where him. And as you can see, keep moving. We can even look at it here. See the, where is it? You want a screw out, then you can see the number actually changes. Oh. Did I just swap the wrong piece of it? Nice. Yeah, you can see now it's 48, 148. So yeah, the degrees keep changing slowly and steady. And it will keep doing that the whole day. So our power will go up quickly. Lovely. Uh, what do we have to do now? We have to produce some pipes and a water canister filler. So water canister filler, silicon. I have silicon somewhere. I have silicon there. Do I have any more? I have two. Lovely. Uh, and it's warm. Idiot. I forgot to do it while it was cold outside. Ah, it's only eight and eight. Come on, come on, come on. Um, This is uh, wasting power. Oh, we can actually take it now. And while we're at, we can might as well mount this one, which is just to have some extra power. Do we have copper in here? No, we don't. Come on. Because I need, uh, then I can charge my batteries a bit better instead of having to place them all the time. So. But anyway, water filler. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We just can put that there. Drink that over there. Now we want some liquid pipe. Liquid. Liquid canister. Do we want that? Technically we do, but we can go without for now. Uh, we want that. A liquid can stop storage. Do we? Yeah, because we're not gonna. No. No, we are going to. to... I am getting myself confused here. Liquid. Okay, let's get the liquid pipe first. Don't need that many anyway. How much iron do we have? We have 363, so pretty good. Already full pound that. Jesus. Okay, so we can take our rinse. Where is my rinse? And pop that there. And pop that there. Now. Oh, it's going everywhere. H. Um, yeah, we want some. What is what? We have that, we have that, we have that. So we have a vent. We want a tank connector for our scrapper. Okay. It's done. Drag that in there. Stop that. We want our scrapper to be facing that away now our scrapper uh, let's just see if we can if we should get 
atmospheric. Do we have enough of that? No, we don't. Let's wait for that for now. Uh, where is our scrubber? Our scrubber is basically a... Mm, there it is. Scrubber, 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 scrubber. Hydrophonics. Scrubber. I could go for the hydrophonics. Portable hydrophonics, but it's... Yeah. It's just not that nice to have. So this is just a very simple machine. Very simple machine, to be honest. It works, of course, but it's... Mm. Yeah, we need an as event. Event passive. Turn you off. No, I did not. Always remember to turn them off. That one needs a battery and two filters, and then that I can actually remove this room from with, with um, yeah, empty this room for whatever we have on the filter. Now we want to uh, finish off the room's integrity for now. Uh, do we, how much iron do we have left? 47, we need some steel sheet. Oh, no, steel sheet. Iron sheet. Iron sheets. Douche. How much do we have here? We have one. Well, that's gonna get us far. The world. I'm just gonna load it all up and then we can always tear down when we need to, if we need to. The reason why I'm building it all up is because getting it caught with your pants down, as you can say, and not having them made in a storm is so far from nice as it can be. Now this is classified as a room, per se. Meaning that the uh, plastic sheet stop. Meaning that the storm will not be as severe severe on it. Oops. Okay. And we want the plastic for the doors. And glass. I think it is. What is it? Crowbar. Yeah. Lovely stuff. We have two doors. Perfect. Ah, next thing, if we have enough, is we want two passive events, two active events. Of course, we don't have enough because we just tempted it all down here. Event, one on each side, then the sensor, and then we can technically hook up the um, airlock vent. I'm writing airlock as well. So we want a vent there, and we want a vent here. Lovely. And we want a no, like this. Active in there and active in there. Did and I am using since up there, so I need a new one. Ah. Okay, first pipe. Pipe, pipe, pipe. 
Why did I not throw the pipe in here? I'll use it all. Oh, I have it on me. That's why I can't find it. It's one. And a straight one. That. They are done. Yoink. In the dew. Okay, so look. <sighs> nice. Should be an automatic system already, so that when it turns off, that one discloses. Okay. No sensor. Iron. Oh. I don't have any more. Right. Last mining trip of the day. Then I think we are ready to set up so our starting hub is actually working. So I'll be right back. Okay. So now we have our uh, plenty of iron. Uh, well, plenty. We have a little bit more iron. So we can do our sensor. And then we can actually finish up our airlock. So we need. Oh, wrong belt. We need a quite a lot of more cables. So let's get on with cables. Waste tank. That's something we can easily fix. Hmm. Also something we can fix. So, waste tank is... This one. So you can just click on it. And then open. And by you doing this with the mouse, is that holding down Alt, then you have free mouse. So, quick little tip. If you want to do it that way. Some people like it, like I, I prefer it that way, but uh, there's a great tip. <clears throat> anyway, let's get putting some cables here. Mm -hmm. Anyway, let's remove this one because we don't want it right there. So, hmm. that. we might, I don't know what we want here right now, definitely not this one. Oh, I think we have no cable now. Thirty-two cables, third cables, hmm, that might be enough. Junction. to go ah cannot do that just close the door let's probe out unable to force close ah right you're gonna force not force close something that's already powered on I did not think that through. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Damn it. Nope. Nope. Do I want to move this now? Mm. Yeah, they're moving. We're moving the the PCA for temporary purposes. That will be coming a battery soon. So we're just moving it away from here now. Oh, come here, come here. So 
crowbar on it. Open up. And take that. Right. You're not turned on now. You do. But this, what is this? Ah. ah, that's why. Okay, so that's inside. Nice. Okay. These are power. Yep, and this is power. Awesome. And also great. Right. Do should not be over there. Now we need our the last thing today. We need our data. What did I put that one? Access card. There. So this airlock is basically just a standard airlock. Hop. Uh, come on. Oh no, turn off. Let's take out the labeler. And this door is inner door. Inner vent. Uh, airlock center. Outer vent and outer door. Okay. And turn on. So. Ah, four, six. So airlock sensor is the center. Click that. Yes, that's correct. Inner vent. No. Outer vent is exterior. Yes. I hate this. Inner vent is interior. Absolutely. <clears throat> Outer vent is exterior. It is. And inner vent is interior. Nice. So here we can see the internal pressure and the external pressure. The external pressure will be... One. And for now this one is two. So, no, not a lot. Let's see if it can do it. Yes, it can almost. So this outside will, will basically be zero. Uh, and yeah, so this works. We have a, we now have a vent that actually works. We almost have an ice crusher. Uh, we have a closed off environment inside. And it's now ready for us to produce a greenhouse and living area. Uh, so yeah, we have to do a little bit of tidy up there so we don't see dirt. But apart from that, we are mm, we're pretty good. Um, so um, yeah, that is all for today. I hope you liked uh, this episode and um, we'll see you next one. Enjoy your day on Mars and have a fantastic rest of your day. See ya. Bye.